Hello everyone, this is Tan here and welcome back to another Advanced Warfare gameplay. This time around it's the SN6 Domination on Green Band and I got the 30 kill streak medal. I think it's called Victorious or Nuclear, I cannot remember. And I got 34 kills without dying um, overall in this gameplay. And I got some kills um, from score streaks along the way too as well. Um, with the Warbird AI control, the bombing run, and Vulcan with no models. Now for the case of the DNA bomb, you have to get 30 kills without dying from your own arsenal, which means your gun and your grenade. I'm not sure if you can, however. I'm not sure if it's, if it's either kills or points. Now, points would be 3,000 points for DNA bomb, and you can still do this sort of objective stuff like, uh, you know, capturing points or getting assist points, like 25 points that count towards the score. I don't know. I don't think it works that way. I think it works like just simply kills. One kill count as one kill. Then two kills, three kills, things like that. I don't think score would really matter for the case of DNA bomb. You just need to get 30 kills. Now, that's hard because it, it's 30, it's not 25 like Kim Strike, Moab, and um, Nuke. Now, if you want to get just the medal, the 30 kill streak medal, you can do it in an easy way like what I'm doing right now. Just simply get lots of kills get um, score streaks as quickly as possible if you can and it's really come down to your preference of what you want to use now for the case of weapon you can of course start off with um, the ball 27 I mean I know but if but that's that's the easiest thing that I could come up with for those of you who want to really get a grip on things you know to have a reliable gun that would really work the ball 27 would work the sn6 um i don't know some machine guns in this game it's kind of hard to tell i couldn't really find like my favorite submachine gun just yet in this game in any case the ball 27 would be my recommendation for those who want to really go for that and then if you feel comfortable then you of course can try out different weapon to increase the challenge why not? Now, um, for the score streaks, um, try not to add lots of models because they'll increase um, the points that require you to earn. So it's much harder. Well, it depends on which game mode you're playing. For domination, each kill will earn you 50 points. And if you in, let's say you capturing the flag, you kill somebody, you get 125 points. And then you capture uh, the flag, fully capture, I think you get another 125 or something like that. So getting kills normally doesn't earn you a lot of points, like in Black Ops 2 where you get full 100 points. In Advanced Warfare, you just get, um, you know, half of it and that's not a lot. Still, um, you still can get these score streaks fairly quickly, just simply, you know, um, do the objective part, and that will earn you um, many scores along the way. And I think that's pretty much about it, though. So, yeah, and it's halfway already. I hope you guys enjoy um, the rest of this gameplay, and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Domination. Capture and defend the flags. Securing Alpha. Enemy has C. Alpha secure. Our UAV is online. We've taken the lead. Enemy has Bravo. Friendly Vulcan above. SS 130. Ready for action. Friendly Vulcan above. Bravo secure. Losing Bravo. Securing Charlie. Friendly bombing run clearing the way. Care package inbound. 
Friendly warbird in the air. Bombing run ready for orders. Friendly bombing run clearing the way. That's how it's done. RTP for debrief. 